which anybody that has owned a distillery knows how incredibly important that is. Why are you laughing? This is a this is an inspiring story. Now another whiskey by request. This is how I wave to people. That's the worst wave. Haven't you ever watched parades? You keep your fingers open and you it's the all at the wrist. <laughs> It's all in the wrist. It's not in the finger joints. So what are we, this is like a fancy little... Yeah, little, this is little, by request. It's got a string. And I'm not even going to try to reach for the comment paper. No, Noah's Mill. Who requested this? Thank, poor. Thank you for respecting my role. I'm just saying. Well boundaries. Earned. Well I was told by Dr. Grant that healthy boundaries are ne necessary in a relationship. You've been actively trying to have boundaries? This is news to me. Yeah. You're yeah. horrible at it. Went to counseling. You're just bad at it. Kyle Carver, Nose Mill. Hey guys, I appreciate the bourbon reviews as I am more of a bourbon fan. Is it possible to get a review of Noah's Mill? Are you reading? Yes. I'm the reader. <laughs> Thanks again for the reviews. Helps out when I'm making my purchases. So he just wants us to get into the Noah's Mill. Later. Okay, so he said this because we did um, Rowan Creek. Rowan, okay, so let here's me, the thing. Me, One of our commenters took me to task on my pronunciation of Rowan Creek. I, okay. Right? You're the only and, person who would pay attention to that. Comment. No, 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 and here's what's funny. He's right, but here's what's funny. I can't remember what he said. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing it wrong again. So what were you reading here? Were you... No, it's just the thing that came with the I think whiskey. You were, I think you were trying to cheat. No, I was. Yeah. See what you... Is it... So, I, okay, so I can tell you what I know about this whiskey. This is and it's another thing I love about bourbon, which is this is Willet Distillery. Bourbon in a wine bottle. Yeah, yeah, it really is in a wine bottle. Uh, this is Willet Distillery, and Willet I remember was liking. not made. Oh, Willet's great. Yeah. And they were not making their own whiskey. They were bottling sourced from other locations. Mm -hmm. Now they own their own distillery, actually producing. And uh, but they sourced this one. Good on the nose. Now originally it was twenty-year-old whiskeys. 18, 20 year old whiskeys. Now it's four to, two, they dropped the age statement. It's four to 20 year old barrels. Mm -hmm. So there are some 20 year old barrels in here. There's also some four year old barrels in here. Uh, the caramel sweetness, slightest bit of vanilla. It's all, it's all caramel. A little bit of all spice, they say. And they say cinnamon. Cinnamon. I'm not getting maybe, cinnamon. Maybe, maybe on the taste. I'm not getting yeah, it but I'm not getting it on the smell. Wow, there's the cinnamon. I said, yeah. Woo. So it's the alcohol that's bringing the cinnamon to play, in wow. my opinion. That, now, what is the proof on this? This is a really wonderful bourbon. Super cinnamon. Mm. 57%. No, I believe it. It's uh, it's alcohol -y. It's lively. Yeah. I'm going to add a little water because I've actually had Noah's milk quite a few times. And right. so I want to explore this Are you a getting bit. as much cinnamon as I am? Oh, yeah. It's, it's like this. What are those candies, the Red Hots? That mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very cinnamony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I add a little bit of water. If you want to try mine before I add water to yours, you can see what the difference is. Mm. It, it made it all candy. I would stick to what you're doing. Now it tastes all cinnamon candy, but mm -hmm. none of the bite of alcohol. Right. And it needed that bite of alcohol. Why? I, I, don't, know if, I don't know if I need the bite. You, you actually like that? I'll trade you. Okay. Yeah. So I think the master distiller no. made the right choice. The thing is, you, in this proof, you had so little. <laughs> you just ruined what I did. Yeah. You just took no. it because you thought you might like it better, and then you undid no, no, I'm, my I'm, efforts. I'm, I'm, uh, oh, okay, okay, okay. I oh man, I'm so tempted to just dump it. The, it's just, it's uh, your room, man. I'm really not cleaning it up at all. That's why I didn't do it. Make all the mess you want. For a split second, I got uh, peanuts on there, but... Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm totally getting that. Yeah. And the peanut, the, the, like the roasted peanuts from the can. Yeah. Like when you peel back that aluminum... But it very quickly gets overwhelmed by the very sweetness. Very sweet. Yeah, the sweetness and the uh, cinnamon. All yeah. right, Kyle, I don't know. I'm not Spice. sure why Kyle asked us to review it. Spicy. Does he have it and he wonders if we agree with him? Or does he not have it and he wonders if it's worth it to buy it? Type words on the place that likes words on the YouTubes. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not uh, my absolute favorite. If you were looking to purchase bourbons, would you go out of your way to purchase? I mean, this is a $50 bottle of bourbon. Um, $50, $60. This is, not, this is not a budget bourbon. Honestly, there'd be probably about um, 15 to 20 bourbons that I could think of that I would pick up before this. Yeah, me too. But there's a bunch that I would pick up after this. 
Yeah, more, more, more after. Yeah. Um, I could totally do Henry McKenna before I did this. Mm. Now, if I was um, feeling like a little bit of cinnamon babka, it is very spicy. You know what this would be amazing with is holiday cocktails. If you're making bourbon-based holiday cocktails, then holy vanilla shit. ice cream. Oh God, that would be so good. Yeah, vanilla ice cream. Little yeah. Bit. Yes, that is exactly what needs to happen. We've solved it. Now we have um, a sommelier, and uh, her website is a little da a little dab of bourbon, and she does recipes of cooking and foods and things with bourbons, mm -hmm. and she's awesome, uh, Christy Martin, and she's a level two sommelier, and I would be super interested to see what she does with Noah's Mill. Mm -hmm. Oh. I started to doubt whether I remember the name correctly all of a sudden. Because <laughs> uh, I'm thinking Rowan Creek. Right, this and so all of a sudden I'm thinking Noah's Creek. I'm like getting the mixed up. sixth <laughs> bottle we've pulled out today. Yeah. Yeah, well they're both Willet products. And so I think the, the, Ro the Rowan is... All right, let me, let me, let me do my, and I say this in the spirit of love. We've lost all momentum. No, 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 no. Go we, see we Chrissy. really have... Go see Chrissy's website. No, I'm not talking about Chris. I'm talking about the energy, the flow. It's like, oh, it's so wait, 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 wait. You and mean in the within no, no. the last within this is a little you know behind the scenes within the last 90 seconds. The high point was vanilla ice cream. <laughs> wait, wait. I said, are you saying we lost momentum in this episode yeah. or in the entire line of episodes leading up to it? In this episode. Okay. I don't well, remember what we called. Well, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> we did other videos. Do you know why? Because the comments are too easy to answer within the comments instead of on camera. We need more interesting questions. No, just you're so picky. For on camera. You're so picky. I can make any question interesting. Oh, really? Yes. Like what? And this is why you're horrible. Are you just going to pick from a... I can look. I can want to put a bigger random All comment. All right, fine. See, I don't need the crutch. Well, you know what? I, I, I will pick a comment from an episode that went up an hour ago, and I don't know if there's any, there may be zero comments. I'll still make it interesting. <laughs> All right. I don't think we have any comments. So it went up an hour ago. On today's video. We have 64 views. Oh, a whole 64. Okay, here we go. We this got, is why we're so famous. Uh, all right, first comment. Shelby Dog. How you doing, Shelby Dog? Uh, is the 31 and a half percent 12 year old whiskey still the rescued Alberta whiskey from the Whistle Pig? Oh, uh, oh, I, oh, I, oh I, yeah. No, this is mine. You shut the hell up. No, no, I answered this already. There's a reply under there. But see, that's how... There's three words. Ah! You reply. It's three <laughs> words. Shall be sorry. I guess I uh, shortchanged you. You did. According to Rex. Yeah. So what's the answer, Rex? It's supposedly both. Ah! <laughs> immediately quotes exactly what I typed. Uh, make up a story, man. All right, so here's the thing with, with Whistlepig. Okay. What's the story of Whistlepig, Rex? And it's really quite gory. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. No, so they they have this farm. Okay. And on the farm, there's animals. Yeah. And That's how it goes. No, yeah, with in, farms. Well, and, and one of the things if you live on, if you have raising animals on a farm, occasionally you need to kill an animal. Yeah. So there's this one pig. Out of spite. There's this one pig, and they go out there and they shoot the pig in the head. The pig doesn't die. Oh. Right. Oh. Yeah. So Ow. the pig is like, oh, if he's, if, he's, if he's that tough of a bastard, we'll let him keep living. The thing is, he lived like be one of the oldest pigs they had, but he had this hole in his head. And every time he breathed and snorted, it would do this whistling sound, which is really fucked up, right? You just have this pig making this whistling sound. But, but it became a symbol of perseverance, which anybody that has owned a distillery knows how incredibly important that is. Why are you laughing? This is, a, this is an inspiring story. This is the whistle pig story. <laughs> what? You can't make fun of the whistle pig. He's a survivor, Daniel. He's a survivor. What's wrong with you? Because it was only when you got to the point with the hole in the head that I realized where the whistle was coming into play. <laughs> it's so neatly tied together. So it's totally true. Oh, this is such a better story than what's on their website. <laughs> <laughs> Can't take that pig down, man. Perseverance. Mm-hmm. Pig got a will to live. <laughs> uh, until tomorrow, may your crazy stay this side illegal. May you return if you like super cringy jokes. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers.